Hello everyone, uh, MPK all the way here. Today we're going to talk about advanced nutrients. This is the master growing line. Um, I'm going to try to explain every single bottle that's in that line. Um, I'm also going to try to explain everything that's in the bottles. So if I have something wrong, please uh, bear with me because there's a lot of information to, uh, to keep in mind here. Um, also, if I make any mistakes, feel free to comment, make them in the comments so I can update them in my video. Um, first off, uh, let me start with the note that this is not an advertisement in any way. This is not a sponsored video. Uh, all the nutrients that I'm going to show and explain are products that I bought myself. Uh, I'm going to use them in my own uh, seed to harvest video. So sit back and uh, enjoy this video. So let me start with our base nutrients. Our base nutrients are basically the Sensi Coco Grow and the Sensi Coco uh, Grow Part B. So we have a Part A and a Part B. We have the same one on this side, but this is these are for the bloom. It's also a Part A and a Part B. Um, these are meant for cocoa. So because I'm growing in Cocoa Choir, um, that's why I'm using these nutrients because there's also a sensi grow and a sensi bloom without the cocoa added basically what it does is the sensi cocoa uh, with cocoa you have the tendency that uh, cocoa binds itself to calcium and magnesium um, this or therefore it will steal it from your uh, from your nutrients um, this can lead eventually to calcium and magnesium deficiencies however with this uh, with this formula um, they optimize the levels of calcium and magnesium so you don't have to worry about that so usually you had to add some CalMac uh, extra as you can see here we had to usually you had to uh, add this Sensi CalMac extra to every fee that you did now while well, they optimize these base nutrients base nutrients it's not needed anymore however if you feel you can always put a small dose of this it says two milliliters a liter uh, but you can always go for uh, for a small dose like half a milliliter or a liter so you always have that cow mag in there it's not needed because they claim that it's in uh, it's in in, uh, in their nutrients uh, the other benefit that uh, cocoa also uh, releases potassium within this uh, within the cocoa itself this will happen over time as cocoa degrades and therefore releasing potassium so with the cocoa grow they um, they changed the amount of potassium traces inside of this newt so you will not have a toxicity of potassium in your plants with the sensi grow normal so without the cocoa part again they will have a higher level of potassium uh, last but not least, they also added to both of these bottles, they added uh, a wetting agent called Wet Betty. Usually, usually you had to um, buy them separately, but now they're included in this uh, in this nutrient line, in this baseline. Uh, basically what Wet Betty is, it's um, a, surf a surfactant that what, what it means is that it reduces the tension for the water to go into the cocoa and therefore better penetration in the cocoa and that will result of course in a better delivery to your plant. So Sensi Cocoa Grow A and B and the Sensi Cocoa Bloom A and B they should be always administered in an equal amount. So if they say that it's two milliliters a liter that they mean that it's two milliliters of this bottle plus two milliliters of that bottle. So always uh, administer them evenly. So next up we're going to our um, strengtheners. We have um, a couple of strengtheners in this line, and the strengtheners are uh, the Rhino Skin. They are it's the B52, and it's the Senzyzyme. These three products are called strengtheners. Uh, basically, uh, let's start off with the B52. So with the B52, what you have is in fact a vitamin boost for your plant. It contains a lot of vitamin B. Uh, for example, it has the B1, B2, B3, B5, and the B7 vitamin inside the bottle. Uh, it also includes some seaweed and some um, kelp extract. Uh, that's will that's like every so with like every vitamin um, it helps your plant uh, your plant to like it heals better or it, it, the the overall health of your plant that's what I'm trying to say will be better with uh, with these vitamins and it also increases the floral production 
Um, what this means is that if you add these vitamins into your newt line, you will buy, basically give them a, 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 a boost in their metabolism and this will speed up their metabolism and also will uh, make them more stress relief. Um, what they also included in this uh, newt is that they included some uh, uh, folic, uh, folic acid and some humids. Uh, humates, sorry for mispronouncing that. Uh, these will also uh, increase your cell production, plus they will increase your metabolism of the plant all in all. So basically what B52 is, it's like a vitamin bomb for your plant. Um, next up we have the rhino skin. Um, rhino skin is in fact our silica, it's our silica base. Uh, silica is used to strengthen your plant cells wall, your plant's cell walls, uh, which those which then increase, of course, the plant's resistance to fungus and insects. So, if you add this to your uh, to your new line, newts, this will strengthen your plant and it will strengthen them against pests from outside. Um, it also helps to make your stems like thick. It makes them a lot stronger as well because of the cell wall uh, strengthening. Um, and it also causes your plant to uptake more CO2, uh, which of course increases the um, uh, nutrient absorption. What it also does is it, it will reduce the water loss through your leaves. So every plant releases water through the leaves, but this will reduce it. With that being said, it will help uh, against uh, or it will guard against whittling. Uh, what, wilt what wilting? Sorry, what wilting means is that a process where the water evaporates from the uh, from the leaf, and the plant will have a tendency to uh, curl upwards, and therefore making its 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 area uh, or surface area smaller. So it needs less uh, water to put in that in that leaf. This will help you from well leaving that leaf intact and leaving the water inside the leaf so basically if you use rhino skin you will get a stronger cell you will get stronger cell walls you will get thicker stems and you will get a high uh, a higher co2 uptake and that's why this product is here to help um, last of the strengtheners is the senzyzyme senzyzyme is um, basically your enzymes uh, these are protein proteins, sorry, that boost uh, the breakdown of uh, organic matter into into another form like newts. Um, the, what that basically means is that it cleans up the the roots. It cleans them up. Uh, it's getting rid of all the dead material inside your cocoa in your medium. So all the dead roots that are inside your uh, your medium, it will get rid of that and it will convert them actually to nutrients. So this will save you in the end because it makes nutrients for free for stuff like it's not for free of course but it, it it's it makes your zone your root zone a lot healthier um, in the process of doing that as i said it also makes these nutrients available again to the new roots so if you don't want that roots taking up your medium um, you will need sensi sensizyme to help you out to get rid of that Basically, all these three products are meant to make your uh, plant a lot stronger, make them more resistant to fungus and uh, insects. Plus, they will get you get rid of uh, dead roots in your medium. Uh, last but not least, this entire thing will give you a lot more vitamins and therefore also making your plant a lot healthier. Um, next up we have, uh, let me see, we have our root mass expanders. These are uh, the Voodoo Juice, it's the Piranha, and we have our Tarantula. So basically what these do, these will make sure that your root mass will expand. Let's first talk about um, the Voodoo Juice. The Voodoo Juice basically is a powerful but very concentrated blend of beneficial microbes. Uh, they inserted like, I don't know, like 12 super strains inside this bottle of microbes uh, with, that will help your plant against root disease. Um, it will break down your nutrients a lot better so your, um, so your roots are a lot more capable to uptake those nutrients and it stimulates root branching for bigger root mass. 
Um, the voodoo juice are actually bacteria that the cocoa is missing uh, by itself because if you grow in soil, there are um, there are um, I said that there are beneficial bacteria already uh, present in the in the soil. With cocoa, we don't have that, so we'll have to add them. Um, if you um, add this, so you will your root will expand. It will help your bacteria to colonize a lot better, breaking down those nodes for your plant. And as you know, bigger roots create bigger plants, create bigger yields. Next up, we have our um, tarantula. Tarant um, Sorry, uh, tarantula, uh, piranha, I'm sorry. Next up we have our uh, piranha. Piranha is a blend of like uh, beneficial fungus, fungi. Um, they have the same purpose basically as the microbes that are found in voodoo juice, food juice and tarantula. Um, the fungi breaks down, again, breaks down the nutrients for a better uptake by the plant. Um, it also protects it against disease, same as this product does. So they basically work together to make a, an, an ideal situation for the bacteria and the, and the fungi in your root zone. So these two together are perfectly fine to combine. Um, where, you, where this voodoo juice, for example, delivers your microbes, piranha delivers the fungi uh, to work alongside and work together. Again, increasing your end result. Last but not least, we have the tarantula. With the tarantula, uh, we have um, uh, also um, a mix of beneficial uh, microbes. In fact, in this bottle, there's another 11 super strains. Some are similar to the voodoo juice, but some are not. So with this being said, they uh, combined, they will make a, a very healthy root zone with a lot of bacteria in there. Um, the microbes uh, in this bottle will also colonize around the roots, protecting them, protecting them from diseases, uh, feeding them a lot of oxygen, and also breaking up the, the nutes that you give them for better uptake for the roots. Um, tarantula is another actually good way to, of adding beneficial microbes, just like the voodoo juice, to your medium. Um, basically, all these three combined are microbes, are fungi of, uh, that are usually found in soil. They are not present in cocoa and therefore we have to add them to our cocoa to get the same pros as a soil medium does without having the problem of overwatering it and without having the problem to have no oxygen in it. Um, so if you combine these three together you will have the biggest um, you have the world biggest uh, potential to have a very uh, m uh, very expanded root zone and therefore giving your uh, plant the best way of uh, taking up the nutrients and um, protecting it against diseases. Um, next up in our list we'll have the butt potency enhancers. What these actually are are the, let me see, are the Nirvana and otherwise it's the butt factor X. So what these do is for, let's start with Nirvana. Nirvana is a whole range of like natural food. Uh, it contains, for example, alfalfa meal. It contains earthworm castings, uh, hummus, uh, seaweed, ex uh, seaweed extract, sorry, uh, yucca extract. It also contains, if I get it right, some bat guana and a mineral called azomites. Um, what these do, these, these natural foods, these, they will increase the natural oils and the terpene, or terpenes production within your plant. Uh, Nirvana bridges actually the gap between a natural grown uh, plant um, that's like it, it, it bridges the gap between a natural grown plant and a hydroponically growing plant. So as an extra, it also um, boosts the speed of growth. So if you want to get as close as possible to a natural grown plant, Nirvana will help to bridge that gap, feeding your plant some natural foods. On the other hand, we have the Bud Factor X. Uh, Bud Factor X is a product that fights, it, it fights your, your plant's immune system. It will trigger it to defend itself uh, without actually causing it harm or stress. So the benefit of that is that it will cause the plant to produce a lot more enzymes um, and therefore strengthening your plant. Um, 
if you strengthen your plant, it will come, become more effective or it will become more resistant to diseases, uh, pests, and even with stressful environments. If you cannot uh, keep your environment in check, this will help you out, causing your plant to stress less about it. Uh, another benefit of increasing the level of enzymes is that the plant starts to produce high quantities, a high quantity of essential oils. Uh, significantly uh, increasing the final weight of your plant of course because the more oil the more weight you get to your plant uh, and last but not least it carries small traces of magnesium uh, that will also uh, nourish the beneficial bacteria found in the root expanders that we just explained the voodoo juice the tarantula and the piranha so if you want a healthier um, if you want a heavier end product sorry I want to trick your plant so they get stronger. Uh, but Factor X will help you out. But both these products will create a higher enzyme production for your plant, causing it to make more essential oils and therefore giving you more weight in the final yield. Uh, next up, we will have our uh, bigger butts. That's Big Butt Cocoa and that's Overdrive. Basically, what Big Butt Cocoa does, it, it contains a wide spectrum of uh, yield boosting and flavor enhancing ingredients. One of the most important ones in this bottle is iron, uh, which is something that cocoa also tends to uh, steal from your, uh, from your plant. And therefore, adding it uh, with this Big Butt Cocoa, you will help your plant to get the right dose or the right efficiency of iron. Uh, it also contains a healthy dose of potassium and, and phosphor, uh, phosphorus. I'm sorry. These are required in large quantities late in the bloom, veg, uh, bloom stage, uh, but they also noticeably increase the amount of bud sites that you are getting on your flower on your plant. Uh, if you're higher, if you're if you want more bud sites, if you want in general more uh, flower production, big bud is the way to go. After that, we have our overdrive. Overdrive basically takes over where this guy ends. So it's designed to optimally swell, uh, mature and improve your flowers in the, the late bloom cycle. It's that extra final push that you're giving your plant to get bigger, higher quality results and heavier butts. Uh, overdrive will basically give you an amazing end result so almost letting you see how the crops pack on weight and size before your eyes so if you use these products in your plants life you will get the best possible result in the end yields will be a lot higher than you've ever seen before these are great products last but not least we have our butt taste and terpene enhancers these are the let's see we have the butt candy over here and we have the flawless finish um butt candy is a special mixture of uh, sugars uh, carbohydrates that will basically give your plant a burst of energy it also causes the beneficial uh, microbes and, and fungi that are in the root zone um that are created by of course our voodoo um, juice our piranha and our um, tarantula to increase their growth production which will make them even more effective and supercharging them to create even a better uh, nutrient environment for your plant um, but uh, candy also increases the sugar levels within the plant itself which not only increases the size and weight of your plant but also intensifies the aroma and flavor of your plant so to give your root zone that extra boost um, and to create an even better aroma or flavor, you will need this product, Bad Candy. Uh, last but not least, we'll have our um, Flawless Finish. With Flawless Finish, as the word says, you will use it in the last week of your flowering stage of the plant. It will cause the plant to um, uptake all of the nutrients left within the medium and within the plant itself. Uh, getting rid of all the salt and the toxic residues that are still left in your soil or uh, cocoa in this case or in your plant and this will end uh, this will end up in a way more cleaner uh, more aromatic and eventually better tasting end product so basically these two products we will use in our grow they are a few but they are actually to help that little extra in the end um, of course, there are a lot more extra advanced nutrients um, that they are made. 
these are the only ones I'm oh, only ones these are a shitload of uh, sorry for that these are a bunch of, um, of of products that we will use in our grow um, the only thing I don't have from the master grow line is the uh, butt igniter that's the only one I don't have because my um, local store couldn't uh, provide that but um, basically I explained a lot of these uh, products to begin with I will also in a later stage upload my uh, feeding plan my feeding schedule that I do for my plants but if you follow my day-to-day -day grow uh, video my daily uh, upload um, you will actually see how I mix my nutrients how I uh, in which order that I add them to my to my uh, to my water and in which quantities I also add them to my flowers so my to my plants so I hope you enjoyed this video I hope I didn't make too many mistakes I did my best to research everything about every product in here um, but again, I'm also new to this um, to this um, nutrient line, and there's not a lot of information found on YouTube that actually explain what these do or how to administer them. So that will be in my next video in how I make my uh, my feeding plan and how I will add them to my um, to my water. So all in all, these are all the products we have. Um, they are a lot so again we have our um, how you call them we have our butt taste and terpene extract uh, enhancers here we have our root zone enhancers our expanders then we have our base nudes the, I'm gonna just put the blow bloom and the grow here but of course there's a part A and a part B we have our um, Our enhancers no not our enhancers our um, we call them our strengtheners these three guys and we have the Nirvana and the butt factor X it's too much to get on this screen so a lot of products as you can see all in all it's a great line they have also amazing nice uh, make pictures made uh, graphics on the bottles they look very uh, they look very cool they have a kind of old style to them and that's something I really like um, so guys that's it for today um, give my video a thumbs up maybe subscribe and I'll see your questions and your comments uh, below so see you in the next one bye bye